This is an escort page. <gasps> I didn't think you said. Not the gas, bro. It's the. Not the gas, bro. It's the. <gasps> it's Nani? <laughs> stop <laughs> funny, bro. Let me stop. <laughs> yeah, the. Oh, oh. <laughs> I cannot believe what is my my eyes must be deceiving this me. Is ridiculous. What's going on, Clutch? What? what up? What up? What up? It's your boy Doug. It's your boy Ross. This is Clutch going rogue. Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, with another video. Unfortunately, ah, the most delusional catfish victim of all time, 90 Day Fiance. You guys loved the first part. Said we had to check out this part. The second part, Tyree, right? Uh, yeah, Tyree, man. Uh, I already knew from the last video when he didn't immediately, you know, not accept it, but like realize all right, trying to find what reason. the situation is. At Maybe hand. somebody took her phone. And, he uh, started trying to reason, and that's when I knew. Yeah, he was, oh, he was dead. no. So uh, we're going to see how down bad it gets. Uh, and and Tyree seems like a cool guy, man. Yeah, man. It's just somebody got to tell him. I don't know. Or maybe they telling him is just. And maybe he's not listening. He Clint. needed to listen to that recording of them admitting. I, I don't know. We're, we're gonna see because he. Yeah, all right, man. Let's Jesus go. Christ. See how down bad he gets. So some part of you still believes that there is some type of hope. Yeah, I do. I still have that hope in my. Is heart. that who is that? But I was also maybe thinking like, what if, like Carmela was like in prison or something. Oh no. <laughs> who is that to him? It better be his family or some shit. I, it's probably family. Like, I doubt it's like a, a yeah, I doubt it's a friend. <laughs> Gotta be his. I know, it sounds crazy. I'm like, sorry, I don't wanna laugh, but. This is the longest episode of Catfish ever. Tyre talked to his fiance online for four years, and then the crew for 90 Day Fiance rolled up, and in like five minutes, they figured out it was some guy named Christian. They didn't even bro. need to call in Eve. Like, can you imagine? But Tyre, he didn't think he was being catfished because he was only sending like thousands of dollars, you know? Not tens of thousands. And apparently, people don't catfish for only thousands. So basically, this man spent four years of his life and a lot of money talking to some guy who's just sending him pictures that he stole from somebody's OnlyFans page. I think when we last left off he was about to hear his fiance's voice for the first time yesterday the producers told me that carmella might not be who she says she is when they reached out to her a man responded and said that he's been pretending to be Carmela for four years. All right, that's it. Case closed, right? That's that's what you would think. But Tyree mm. is a master of his craft. Do not underestimate his ability to tell the wildest stories to explain all of this. And honestly, oftentimes his story isn't even preferable to the catfishing scenario. I'm like, dude, just admit you got catfished. That's actually right. not even as bad. He'll be like, oh, what if she went to prison and then got out and went back with her husband? And I'm like, wait, is that? Is, would you rather have that? Is that better no. than catfishing? Did Carmella reach out to you last night? No, not at all. But don't worry, that's just Carmella. That's just how she is. You know, she asked me for money. I say no. She ignores After me for three months. Out. It's a joke. It's just, she's just messing around. I'm just having trouble processing everything just because of, you know, the amount of time we spent together and, you know, the conversations we had. It just cuts to a bunch of texts of her asking him for money. I'm going to miss that so much. The bond and the love that me and Carmella had for each other. I still have a belief that. Carmela is, you know, Carmela. What? Imagine someone asking about your relationship and you're like, yeah, it's going great. You know, we've been together four years. Still working on uh, the the figuring out if she's a human, you know? All I know is I'm oh sending words God. out and there's words coming back. Like that's, that I can guarantee you. Like that, I have gotten some words awful, on my phone that if weren't there the before I... I don't really know what I should do or, or what the next step is. I kind of need someone to, to have support right now. So today I'm gonna rip off the band. Where is he going? I'm gonna tell Ronald and Lashanti <laughs> and my siblings about Carmella. Oh, uh, okay. Like is, uh, help me think of what my next step should be. So this is unbelievably mm. awkward. I don't even think his siblings know about this relationship at all. In uh, all in one conversation, they're not only going to find out that he's being catfished, but they're going to hear the guy's voice. So far, this whole season has just been him meeting uh, up with his friends never. and family Told in various him. restaurants and parks. And they're like, hey, dude, tell? you're being catfished. Here's undeniable proof. And then he gets angry and storms out. But then the next day, he's like, you know, but maybe, maybe Carmela is just a magical water nymph who hibernates for months <laughs> at a time. Water and then nymph. comes up and uses He's the voice childish. changer from Scream to talk to the producers from 90 Day Fiance. Start from the beginning. Oh no. 
um, in an international relationship. International. In 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 four years. I've never heard. Her name is Mahogany. Damn. Four <laughs> years. Yeah. Jeez Louise. <laughs> Jeez Louise. I would have never known. I thought he was asexual. I didn't think he liked either one. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro, cut the clip. Cut, cut, cut all that out. You know what? I think this was a bad idea. <gasps> this thing is on. Oh, I ain't even know. You, you, I thought you was asexual. Damn. Dog, that's his sister? <laughs> Sheesh. Fuck, bro. This you had to laugh that one off, bro. Yeah. Cause damn, they ain't even think he was talking to women like that, bro. <laughs> Fuck, dog. I know he want to be a nigga on camera, but, but he's trying to be. <laughs> yeah, there's cameras there. He's trying to be, you know, yeah. supportive. Supportive. I would have never known. I thought he was asexual. I didn't think he liked either one. Oh my God, <laughs> like yeah. either one. <laughs> See, right now they're just happy for him, but it's it's really sad to see the slow downward spiral of them realizing this is well, yo, definitely not family. real. And when I say slow downward spiral, I mean head-on collision in about 15 seconds. Who is she? Uh, her name is Carmella. We chatted on Snapchat. We kind of got like a really good bond, and that's kind of how I still talk to her. You know when I went to Barbados last year? That's what you went for? Oh, well, that's cute. Like, I went to Barbados, and then she, uh, she never showed up. Oh. Okay. He brought that up like it was going to be this amazing romantic story. Right, why did you I don't know bring why, but the way he introduced that is so funny to me. Bro, yeah, I'm in an international it. relationship. You know, when I'm I went in to love. Barbados? Everything is going well. You remember when yeah, I went to Barbados last up. year? She ghosted me the whole time. Never even met her. Yeah. Oh, we're going to get married. Spin, we're going to have bro. kids. I can't wait. Camilla and I were dating for three years before I decided to go to Barbados. Like, I was super excited to see her. And the plan was for her to meet me at the villa after the quarantine was over. So after I got my negative test results, I text her, you know, when can we meet? But she didn't respond. Okay, how is there any coming back from this? You flew across the world, you spent a bunch of money, and then she didn't even meet you at yeah, all? Bro. She just ghosted you the entire time? I can't believe he tells this to people and then expects them yeah, to be supportive like... of the relationship. But at the same time, I guess David took like five or six tries to meet his fiance, you know, the person that was sending him emojis for like eight years. And that clearly all worked out, you know? He, he got to go bowling with her. He creepily tricked her into into getting a kiss. He took a couple <laughs> pictures where she looked visibly uncomfortable. He flew in that she couldn't come out to her own hometown or home city, whatever it is, country, <laughs> to come see you. She said it was because of COVID. What? So how come you didn't 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 push your issue more? Why was you so like docile? <laughs> I was in love and I didn't want to like push her away. How does this guy have so much patience? It's impossible. It doesn't make any sense. Ass. Unfortunately, he's like the perfect catfish victim because he yeah, will do bro. all the work for you. You don't even have to make an excuse. He'll nope. do it. He'll make the excuse for you. Yeah, hey, babe, so I just flew all the way to your country and spent all this money. Do you want to meet up? Nope, can't. Sorry. Oh, okay. I get it. You know, you're busy with your job and you're you know, COVID 19. <laughs> No, I just I just don't want to. Oh. Plain and simple. Oh, yeah, of course, because yeah, the job. That's and the ridiculous. COVID and the, bro. Are you hearing the words that I'm saying? Just just give me money. That's all I want. Um. Uh. Oh shit. I'm gonna I'm gonna need like a Jimmy Neutron brain blast to explain this one. What? You gotta give me a second here. Yesterday, uh, the producers told me that it wasn't really her I was talking to. It was actually Mahogany. a man that was pretending to be Carmela. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Oh, wow. Isn't that Damn. crazy? He just tossed all of this onto them within the span of like two minutes. So I have some big news, guys. I'm in a relationship. I went to see her in Barbados last year. She ghosted me, didn't show up. The producers of this show just told me that she's a dude. That's a really long time to act like somebody else. Four yeah. years. I know, and I don't know what to do now. It's like, Damn. I just don't know what to do next. Um, stop talking to the guy, I guess it would be the next step. I would yeah, say, I mean, unless on. you like the guy still. That, there's nothing wrong with that. You can yeah. go for it if that's your... I mean, if so anyway, his siblings <laughs> talk him into listening to the phone call between the producers and Carmela. This is a recording of a conversation one of our producers had with Christian after we first made contact. Oh. Hey, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Right. Thank you so much, Dante. Oh, you're welcome. So, oh, okay. Oh, hold on, wait a minute. God damn. damn. Hold on. That was damn, son. Where'd you find it? That's exactly what he sound like. <laughs> Aren't you the nigga from the mixtapes? <laughs> it's not funny. Sending emojis. It's not, not even funny, emojis, man. Actually. It's not funny because it, it obviously, it, you know, feelings. He had feelings involved in, and people that do that, man, you guys, 
Go fuck off, bro. <laughs> yeah, to pick it on you, you know in the situation, the and you know you, you know you're taking advantage. You're taking man. advantage, bro. You gonna get yours, man. I'm Just, glad she. I mean, she was holding his hand. Yeah. I'm good, thank you. Right. Thank you so much, Dante. Are you welcome? So, oh, sorry, it's okay. Uh, I'm Christian. Okay, so he storms out. That makes sense. What What is left to figure out now? Why does this continue? Why, why am I going to have to go to another scene after this? This is where the serious <laughs> denial starts because now he has actually yeah, heard what the been person it. sounds that like that he's been yeah. talking to for four End years. Yet he is still searching episode. for hope. So everybody just keeps pummeling him with more evidence over and over again. Today, I'm meeting up with my sister, Lashanti. It's been a really hard couple of days because the producers are telling me that my girlfriend Carmela is actually a man girlfriend, named bro. Christian. Yes, they are telling you that because they're right. That's, that's the answer. What did we do? I'm going to lose it here. Why are they in a park? Why are they in a park talking about this again? Yeah. Uh, honestly, I'm still trying to like process everything cuz I know it's been <sighs> a few days but it's still kind of like it's still fresh on my mind. What's, what's like, the process? Dude, man? I'm getting deja vu here. He's still he's talking about processing this. He's uh, still processing. How long do you need to process everything? I'm just having trouble processing. You're never going to process this. It doesn't make any sense. It's not meant to be processed. Yeah. He's just going in circles at this point. Yeah. It's like the catfish version of the movie <clears throat> Memento. Do you still in the back of your mind think that she is real? Uh-oh. A little bit, mainly uh, because she hasn't deleted me yet on Snapchat or blocked me. Oh yeah, you should probably process that one a little bit more. Uh, Trust me. There is someone behind these messages that I have a deep connection with. Uh, and I do think that it could be a big misunderstanding. Yeah, it is a big misunderstanding. Because you think that you're talking to somebody else that you're not actually talking to. You're misunderstanding the situation. I would love to hear his explanation for this, or any possible explanation at all. The producer was telling me that I do have a message from her. The thing I cannot video call you because I'm not the girl in the photos. I know it that I have not been honest with Tyree. I've been lying to him for almost five years. At first, it was a way to get money since most of us are so poor here. Um, I did start liking him, but I can't be with him. I feel so bad, but I really needed money. So try to guess which part of this he decides to focus on. Showing him this stuff doesn't really seem to matter at all. He's still going to feel how he feels at the end of the day. They could show him the most irrefutable proof that he is not talking he's to who he thinks he is, and he's still going to deny it and find some way to explain it. I'm like even more confused now because it's like it's saying two things. Like I can't be with him, but then at the same time, I love him. So it's just like, I don't know. There has to be some truth to something in there, so. I love the look of astonishment and disappointment in her face. I think yeah. she's realizing that this is just pushing him even further into it. Yeah. So you feel like this person loves you? They're saying the right things, that's for sure. Oh, bro. Well, uh, that's uh, one way to put it. God. So in the next part, they reverse image search some of the pictures that she sent him, and they actually found a lot of them on an escort site, which, Jeez. of course, only made things even worse for Tyree. Because then, I think he believes he's actually talking to that person and not somebody who just took all of the pictures from various websites. I don't think Lashanti knows how deep my relationship is with Carmela. There was just so much between us, even over text. Oh, great. So we've gotten to the you don't understand how deep our love is phase. I don't even know how I feel, but honestly, I... I I, I want more answers. You don't think you want to block her? I'm going to give it a few more days. This has got to be the most patient family I've ever seen. Fact. You don't think you want to block her? Right. Hey, you don't think you just want to block her at this point? You're going to give it a few more days, huh? You think those few more days are going to make a difference? Okay. <laughs> All right. You know what? I wouldn't even worry about it. I'm sure everything's going to make sense in the next See few the brother, days. I'm sure Carmella yeah, is a real person I, that totally man, exists. And you, you guys are going to fall in love and get married. You. Yeah, that, those are things that are going to really do, happen. Man. Yeah. You see, I would lose it. I have no idea how she sits there and holds it together. I mean, after reading that email, it's kind of clear what's happening here. I just don't know why it's not getting through to Tyre. Just a scammer. Scamming people. Yeah, that's it. That's the end of it. Is Maybe. It? Maybe just need a little bit of time. <laughs> Yeah, don't worry. Just give it a couple days. What's, we'll meet in another park again and have the same for? conversation. So you said she hadn't um, responded to the Snapchats, right? Yeah, she hasn't responded at all. She just opened up the messages maybe like two days ago. Just let it go, bro. She's looking at them because, you know, that's confirmation that she's seen them. Well, there you go. At least she's opening them and ignoring you. Just and that's just coincidentally it. happening at the same time that you found out she was a catfish. And Even honestly, though that's not her, though, like you want him to respond? That's the thing that I still kind of think that it might be her. 
Yeah. So some party still believes that there is some type of hope. <laughs> I like how every time they show her, she's progressively more astonished and disappointed. And that's the thing is a lot of people are just going to feel bad for Tyrae, which I understand, but there is no possible way to influence him in any positive nah, way. Bro, it's an impossible nah. task. You will never accomplish it. He is not going to listen to anybody. Carmella is real to him. And that's yeah. really all you can say. Yeah, I do. I still have that hope in my heart. But I was also maybe thinking like, what if like Carmella was like in prison or something? Sniggered. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, I am serious. What if Carmella's in trouble? Carmella's in trouble. Fuck? And he just goes sprinting in the other direction. He's trying to like stop. I don't know how man, mental health is a real thing. Yeah, bro. that's that's he that's needs what it to is. talk to someone professional yeah. to unpack this because Something. not even not even family can get to you, bro. I'm sure it's friends like definitely can't get to you. Prison? Where that come from? Hey, like, bro, just. Oh. Just moving the goalposts every time somebody proves to you that you're wrong, you so switch it. Cringe. It's just <laughs> fucking damn. Pop witnesses to see if they've seen her. I Have you seen a woman, possibly a man, a man, either a man or a woman? It's either a woman named Carmella or a man named Christian. They're either they're somewhere between five foot four and six foot three. They either live in Barbados or ten minutes down the street or anywhere between those two points. No, let me explain though, because like you know how when people are in prison. And they need somebody to like talk to because they're like locked up. Like a pen pal? Yeah, so maybe this is what happened. She got released. This nigga is like creating with her husband or something. What? Okay, uh, so. That yeah. makes it worse! I'm speechless. Like I said, not only is that scenario ridiculous and unlikely, but it's it's worse than the reality. <laughs> that is way After worse. After we reverse image searched Carmella a couple weeks ago, I did my own research. And Damn. I found some stuff that he needs to know. But I'm just worried about telling him because he's still vulnerable. And I don't want him to get his heart broke even worse. But that's the thing is if you prolong this and never tell him, all you're doing is preventing him yeah, from ever having a real meaning. Rip the at the same off. time, like I said, no information is going to make any difference anyway. So just w whatever. This is an escort page. <gasps> I didn't think you said... <gasps> <laughs> what the gas, bro? It's the... The gas, it's bro. The... <gasps> Nani? <laughs> stop it's funny, bro. Let me stop. <laughs> yeah, the. Oh, oh. I cannot believe what is my. My eyes must be deceiving this me. Is ridiculous. It's gonna make any difference anyway, so just whatever. Uh, this is an escort page. <gasps> I can't believe. <laughs> this is her, out. right? She said she was living in Barbados. They lied, dude. That people, do, do people know that people lie about shit in the world? The worst part is like, uh, oh, this phone got me out of it. I love that little half-ass phone toss because you know he doesn't actually want to destroy his phone. Right. He's just like, I've had enough of this. Get it. He tosses it like three feet over onto the grass. Yeah, yeah that's that's right. Now move the camera oh, over phone. so I can go retrieve it yeah. without you knowing. This phone anyway, got me that's, into um, this. that's it. There's no conclusion. That's that's where we are right now. I hope everyone enjoyed the video. Thank you all for stopping by. I hope you guys have a wonderful week, and I will see you in the next one. Not you messaging. Not you. <laughs> Not the messages site. <laughs> and you being naive. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's his response. Just fuck yeah. this fuck. The I phone did done. it, bro. Snapchat did it. Yeah. The dude was the phone. Oh, oh my. <laughs> Somebody said my sister would bounce me off the pavement if I came on TV acting like this. <laughs> I imagine the whole season is just him processing. <laughs> oh, nah, bro. Yeah, bro. Uh, it, it, I, I feel bad for the guy, but at the same time, man, he, he got to He got to <laughs> get, get, get himself out of that, man. Yeah, bro. Well, I don't know, man. So let us know if y'all... Got an update on Tyrae if Tyre. he ever retrieved his phone. <laughs> he definitely got it back. Oh my God. And if he ever, moved. you know what I'm saying, moved on processing, <laughs> let us know. You know what he probably gonna do? What? What? Meet the, meet the real Carmella since he knows she an escort. <sighs> uh, 
I mean, you should get some get no, get, no, get your money's no, worth. No, hell no. At least he gets his money's worth, right? No. And get to meet the real Carmilla and experience it, right? He gonna go down a deeper rabbit hole. <laughs> <laughs> Some things you experience, you don't come back from. Facts. So, Fuck yeah, it, hopefully bro. somebody has an update on Tyree, man. <laughs> this nigga went to the escort site. I know, <laughs> I know you don't know me, but I know you a lot. <laughs> I know it's you. Oh my god! You said you were in Barbados. I'll come see you. I'll come see you, though. <laughs> in Cali or wherever you're at. Vegas. Oh, my God. If y'all enjoyed it, somehow, make sure you run with the like, subscribe. Let us know what else we can be checking out, man. This is ridiculous, man. I can't believe he went through all this malarkey to then his biggest thing was to just throw the phone. <laughs> Blame the phone. Fuck this Because the phone is what got you into this. Right. Yeah. This is interesting, man. So I don't know how it gets more down <sighs> bad than this. But hey, if y'all want to continue series like this, make sure you run up the likes. Let us know in the comments. Keep on supporting <laughs> us, man. Catch y'all in the next one, man. Peace out. Alrighty, man. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me cause I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me.